What is up, y'all? It's your girl Lala, aka Lachelle, aka Shell, aka Michelle, my bell. Give me about two seconds to check my audio and I'll be right back with y'all or whatever. Okay, audio good, body good. I like that lady. <laughs> All right, y'all. So this is a really, really, really quick tutorial. First and foremost, thank you so much for joining me. I just wanted to show you all how to buy your newborn clothes, your Zuby newborn at that, because I've gotten a lot of messages and this takes a lot more effort to type it than it does to actually just show y'all. So first and foremost, you need to go to the Zuby store and get the Animesh piece. Once you get the Animesh piece, then you buy the textures. So let me run out and do that or whatever. Ooh, okay, that is loud. I'm so sorry, y'all. Definitely didn't mean to do that. Okay, so here we are in a Zuby store. I'm on mic down because, yeah. And let me put my camera on friends only so it's not too laggy in here. So as you can see, when you get to the Zuby store, um, it has three different areas. It has a Zuby store for, well, it also has clothes over there, as y'all can see. But it has like the Zuby avatar stores for the babies, the uh, child avatars, all of that. You're just going to come straight to the Zuby store. Like I said, this isn't going to be a long video. I'm hoping to keep it in under 10 minutes if the lag permits me. So you come into the Zuby store. Burr, 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 and where are their clothes? Um, hold on. Somebody else is in here. Let me go ahead and turn their mic down. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Boop, boop. All right, there we go. So, we are in the Zuby store. Let me make sure y'all can still hear me. Yeah, so we are in the Zuby store, and the clothes are over here. <laughs> so, you just keep walking straight back. Now, rule number one, when you come into the Zuby store, the newborns and the Zuby babies wear two different clothes. You, they are not interchangeable. So if you buy just Zuby baby clothes, your newborn cannot wear them. I'm gonna tell you that right now. Hey, cyanide filled candy. AKA Kenzie. It's so nice to see you. So, like I was saying, sorry y'all, it looks like only two other people are in here. So when you come in the store, remember newborn clothing and regular baby clothes are not interchangeable. If you have a newborn, you need to buy them newborn clothing. If you have a Zuby baby, which is an older baby of course, you wanna buy them the actual Zuby baby clothing. Another thing, the newborn babies, their clothes do not go in the closet. So if you have a Zuby uh, baby closet, you cannot put the newborn clothes in there. I think she's working on it. For now, you just have to res them on the ground. And that's another video for another day. Because like I said, I'm just showing y'all how to buy them tonight. So you come into the Zuby store, walk back towards the furniture, the nursery stuff. Somebody asked me where you buy that too. Same place. As y'all can see, furniture is right across from the clothing. So when you walk in this room, remember... The Zuby baby and Zuby newborns are two different things. All you have to do is look at the bottom of the rack. It is labeled. It says Animesh newborn. If you go to the other side, which is even a whole different color. So notice the Animesh newborn clothing is pink. The Animesh baby clothing is blue. Remember, blue for Zuby babies, pink for Zuby newborns. And it has all of the boys versus girls clothes or masculine versus feminine. However you label your kids clothes, whatever, it's here. So what you have to do when you purchase baby clothes or newborn clothes from Zuby is you have to buy the Animesh shell first. Maybe it's not called a shell. I don't know. Whatever. <laughs> but you have mittens, cloth bun, baseball cap, etc. So do I have a baseball cap for baby Noah? I'll do the pacifier. So what you'll first have to do is buy 
this pacifier. If you want to get your baby a pacifier, as you can see, you can pay $550 Linden, or if you have Z credits, you'll just left click it instead of right clicking. You'll left click it, click buy for me, and then you say, hey, I want to buy it, and this is for you to buy it using Linden's or use your Z credits. Z credits are what you have in your HUD. If you want people to buy you gifts, i.e. for like your baby shower, you want them to get you a gift card because the gift card turns into Z credits. And on your HUD, that's what you can use. I'm not gonna get into that tonight. But you first have to buy the Animesh shell. Like I have a pacifier for baby Noah, so I first had to buy the shell and then your baby comes with a texture HUD. You're just gonna right click, add it like you would any other HUD. Let me make sure you all can actually see this. Yep, you can. Okay, so you would just add it. And while you're in the HUD, make sure you have shop highlighted. Now me, I had other Zuby babies. So all of the stuff that I purchased for them is also in this texture HUD. Shout out to Carrie for that because now I can use the same stuff I bought for them for baby Noah. Big <laughs> So here on the HUD, you have multiple filters that you can choose from. Let me move it to a place where y'all can actually see a little better. So you have multiple filters that you can choose from, like all brands. You click it, and then you can pick your favorite brand if you have one. All categories. That's taking too long. <laughs> you have all meshes. So this is where you pick which shell. Notice that it's blank because that's how it's gonna look when you put it on your baby until you buy the textures. And you have to buy the textures from the hood. So as y'all can see in the thumbnail, for example, I have a winter hat for baby Noah. So let me find the shell on the texture hood. These are all the pieces that you can buy. <clears throat> are we just gonna take all day? Not just today. I could have just used the search option, but y'all know I like to be difficult. Uh, okay, I'll do this one. So, oh, poop. I didn't want the mask. I just had, you know what? I'm not going to do it. I'm not. I'm not going to do it. I'm going to put in ruffles. So, here you go. Prime example. There's a search option, right? You can go in the search option. I'm just gonna put ruffle because it's taking all day. Maybe because I'm on the sim and it's making my HUD a little laggy. I don't know, but y'all know we ain't about to be here all night. <laughs> so you click the search box, you'll get a little pop-up. Boop, type in what you want, hit submit, and then it will sort all of the applicable items in the HUD for you. So for example, <clears throat> baby noah has this this is called the ruffle onesie i believe let me go so i can show y'all the actual shell so i had to go buy okay i'm scrolling too fast I'm scrolling too fast guys i had to come and buy the onesie i think it's called ruffle onesie or something like that where is it at y'all uh, uh, uh. i might have scrolled too there it is okay so the this this particular one is called the long onesie ruffle, right? So what I would do is other way, other way. What I would do was is I would purchase this shell. Again, you can right click pay if you want to use Linden. This is only 200 Linden or left click buy for me or buy as a gift if you want to buy it for a friend. And you're going to click buy for me if it's for yourself. And then you have the option to buy it using Linden or your Z credits from your Zuby hood. Again, if you're trying to do it for a friend, like maybe you want them to buy textures because they already have the shell, then you want to go get them a gift card. Now, I bought this long onesie ruffle. I already bought this shell. It comes blank, just like it looks on the box. However, if you look here, this is where you'll find your textures. And all you would do, I'm just gonna give you like a mock example, is say I wanna get him this one, right? I want his onesie to look like this. I'm gonna go in my HUD and click that little 
turquoise looking sign where it says buy for a hundred and then it asks me it tells me hey shell you got 724 zuby credits you can buy it with my credits or I can use Linden. And from my understanding, it's a one for one swap. So if it costs 100 Linden, it costs 100 credits. So I would just click, oh, Z credits. I'm not buying it because I don't want this one, <laughs> but I'm just trying to show y'all. I would click it. And once you purchase it, you'll see the little buy sign go away. Let me buy something I actually would put on him so I can show y'all. I don't like that one. And that's no shade to the um, vendor at all. Um, I could have got him that camouflage one, huh? Okay, let's get him this blue teddy bear one. So I'm going to click the blue. I left click the blue sign. And then I got the pop-up asking me if I want to use Linden's or credits. I'll use my credits. So it's 120 Linden's or 120 credits. See how that buy sign disappeared? Cool. Now, I, it's as simple as me going into my wardrobe or you can do it after you purchase it once you link it with your baby by just clicking that icon being around your baby that's another video for another day you'll be able to just click the picture from your hood and then your baby will be wearing what you bought so this will go from looking this blank white anime shell to this cute little blue teddy bear piece and if you didn't notice on the hood they have these magnifying glasses so that way you can zoom in and look at it and see what you're actually buying because i know that those icons look small and you probably want to make sure it's exactly what you want but it will go again from this white looking shell to this cute little blue ruffled teddy bear set so that is how you buy clothes for your newborn now if y'all want to see how to put them on i'll do that in a separate video but like i said i just wanted to show y'all how to buy it because a lot of people have been asking me with the exception of clothes diapers bottles vitamins if you're breastfeeding and soap you would buy everything else from the zuby store so like you see they have a swaddle y'all already saw baby noah swaddle the swaddle can be used for the newborn if you were wondering because like I said I know I said some of this stuff is for babies only and then they have a bottle towel then they have elf ears and you can buy all the accessories here you come to the Zuby store to buy your hair your clothing shells remember you just get the shells so if you want pants you'll get some blank pants and then you go into your texture hood to buy the actual clothing texture here is a example of the zuby nursery you can use all of the items except the closet for your newborn and once you transition from having a newborn back to a zuby baby then the baby can use all of it. So that's one thing I appreciate. Like I said, I have a lot of furniture from the twins and I didn't have to buy a thing for baby Noah. I did, <laughs> but I didn't have to. So like y'all see, you can buy the entire nursery set here at the Zuby store or you can buy it piece by piece. You see each piece is separate. They have the chair, the high chair, they have the crib the closet all of that stuff is right here the bathtub and yes you will need most of this to take care of your baby yes you have to bathe them so you would need the bathtub you have to change their diaper so you would need a changing table now there are some places like i know moss and mink for example that they sell zuby baby compatible products other than that i get all my stuff from the zuby store i'm sure there's a list out there but y'all asked me and that's what i got for you <laughs> So as you can see, you can buy your baby's hair from here and there's a variety of textures. And while I see that their hair is already colored, you buy the other colors of your hair from the texture hood. This, that's right, the same place y'all just saw me buy the texture for the onesie. Say you want this little pigtail set right here, but you rather your baby have bright red hair or dark black hair, you would buy this just like you would the clothing shell, and then you go into the Zuby texture hood and buy a different color of hair. Say I wanted these Bantu knots for baby Noah, right? But his hair is not brown, he's a naturally redhead baby. Shout out to Love Mama for putting me and his dad's jeans together. <laughs> but he's a naturally redhead baby. I would buy this, See, right click pay 250. 
I would buy this and then go into the HUD and buy the red hair version. Same concept as with the clothes. So you can buy hair for your baby at the Zuby store. They have earrings, whether you want hoops or studs. Again, you can buy the, you buy the shell from the Zuby store and you go into the texture HUD for the actual texture. So if I wanted him to have pink studs or blue studs or lime green studs, I would get it from the texture just like y'all just saw me do with the onesie. So for all of you who keep asking me, how do you buy stuff for your baby? This is how you buy stuff. As far as toys from the newborn, that's another video for another day. You can't come here and buy it though. That's it. <laughs> I want to thank y'all so much for watching. I hope this has been informative. I try not to make it too, too long, but I also wanted to go in detail. I believe he has some videos as well. However, I know that y'all prefer the lives and whatnot. So again, thank you for your support. If you have any more questions, go ahead and hit me in my inbox. If there's something that you want to see specifically, I will show you. Just let me know. Other than that, y'all have an amazing night. I love y'all for free. Peace.